Hey everyone, it's Kristen and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having an awesome day. So for today's video, you guys, okay, I'm so excited. When I first seen this, I thought it was fake until I seen New Fizzy actually confirmed and we're gonna be checking it out. So first thing I seen was David, who was actually, he used to be the community manager. I believe that was the title in Adopt Me. So as soon as I seen him like this, I thought it definitely needed to be legit. So this user says the old Adopt Me is back and it is paid back, but it will be temporary. You will have to pay 25 Robux to access it, but as soon it will be free for everyone and they are planning to bring several things to the new Adopt Me RP. More remembering Adopt Me with pets will continue. So the first picture they posted is, we have so many more things planned, adopting puppies, mini games, and furniture. So this is the OG, you guys. This is the original Adopt Me in its original state. You can even see one of the buildings in the back with the UI, the old nurseries, some of the old buildings, some of them were not even open. Oh my gosh, you can even see the lighting in this. So here it is. So this is created by Dreamcraft. I have found it and we are gonna be checking this out. So of course I wanted to make sure again that this was legit and I seen New Fizzy commented on it. So I am following the official New Fizzy from Uplift Games, one of the original creators of Adopt Me and they posted the eyes, which you guys know I love those eyes. It always means super exciting things to come. And he says so much more to come, like shadow dragons and frost furies. Can't wait, haha. -ha. So yeah, we already have those. And he's kind of just like foreshadowing how Adopt Me is now. I will leave a link for this game in the video description so you guys will know which one is the real legit legacy Adopt Me. So here it is. And like I said, you guys, I will leave a link in the pinned comments as well as the description so that you guys know you are clicking on the official legit Legacy Adopt Me. So we have Legacy Adopt Me 2017 created by Dreamcraft, a snapshot in time, a land of no pets. This is the version of Adopt Me from 2017, the year it released. So guys, the only thing with this is it is 25 Robux. Now because it's 25 Robux, I am assuming this is here to stay. I can't see them charging it and taking it away. I don't know if they can do that. So I'm gonna go ahead. I'm actually going to pay, would you like to buy access to the place Legacy Adopt Me 2017 from Dreamcraft for 25 Robux, yes. Let's go ahead, buy access. Okay, so we now have full access to the official Legacy Adopt Me. Let's go ahead and jump into game. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna be taking so many pictures, so you're gonna have to ignore a screenshot taken. So we have Adopt Me, play store codes. Let's go in and play. So we need to choose a role as a baby or a parent warning. This game is still in development, so you may experience bugs. That is okay with me. Oh my gosh, you guys. Okay, welcome to Adopt Me, the start of earning money. Find a baby to adopt. Become VIP. Wait, can we? This you already own, your account has not been charged. Okay, so what do we have over here? So we can buy bugs. Can we actually buy? Okay, so they currently don't have um, buck buying enabled. Let's go to our inventory. Let's see if we have anything. Currently, there is nothing in our inventory. And what about this? Return to the main menu. Okay, so let's go over into the nursery first. <gasps> Wait, there's so much going on. Wait, are we able to get in here? Or is it still glitched? It still might be actually like, oh gosh. Oh gosh, wait, I think I'm stuck. Let's go back to the main menu. Parent, let's go ahead and get started <laughs> again. <laughs> okay, it is daytime. <gasps> Guys, okay, you probably remember I did post a video way back a long time ago on my channel, but this is actually here. It looks like to stay. So you guys will be able to come in and enjoy. So we do have the nursery over here. So here's the original nursery. We can even 
Normally we can go over, but for some reason, let's click E out. We don't have the IP, so we're actually not able to go in there. If you guys want to see what it looks like, I do have a video of me actually getting in that VIP. A warning falling tree. So when this game released, you guys, originally in 2017, the pet store was not open yet. It was coming soon. We also have the baby shop, so let's go in here. Let's see what this looks like. So we have all of the original rattles, the stroller, the formula, and some of the cribs here as well. What else do we have over here? So the hot air balloon was currently not functioning as well, coming soon. And the car dealership. Oh my gosh, look at everybody over at the playground. I am so excited about this, you guys. What do you think? Are you excited? Are you able to get the access? Oh my gosh. Okay, so here are some of the original vehicles as well as the bike and the motorcycle. We don't really have any money though. I can't jump. I can't jump. <laughs> I can't jump to say hi. Hi, if you see this video. Oh my gosh. Okay, so what else can we go into? I know that there is the homes. And okay, warning, fallen tree. I do see a bike over here. So we do need to figure out how to get money. Probably gonna need to adopt some kids. Maybe we can start a new series. If you guys are interested in seeing me build up my life in the original Adopt Me. So that is the ice cream shop. There is the clothing shop as well. So let's check out what the ice cream shop looks like now. It does still have the same exterior. You can buy the cones, you can sit over here, and there is some loungewear here as well. And next to it is the, I believe this is the toy shop. So if we go inside the toy shop, I do have a cone as well. Oh, somebody gave me an ice cream cone. So at the time there was no toys, but there is the hula hoops, the pogos, the teddy bears, the boxes, and the floor is very interesting. It's like rolled up on the end. <laughs> Okay, and across is actually going to be the arcade, which is not currently open yet, and the clothing shop. So let's go in the clothing store and look around. So this was the original. I actually remember seeing this already. So there's like all of the items that you can get wearing game, masks, wigs. You can also go upstairs here as well. And there's all of these items and crayons that you can try on over on this side. There's a bunch of different outfits as well. And if we go back outside, oh my gosh, you guys, there's like homes. We're not going to be able to get inside any of the homes, I don't believe, because I don't have enough money. But I do have videos. I will leave a link where you guys can check it out. We do have the town hall in here as well. So we can go inside and we do have Be Think and New Fizzy in the back as a statue at our meeting place. There we go. This place is huge. Oh my gosh, okay. So I believe the only other places that we do have, we don't have any vehicles right now that we can use, but I'm pretty sure we have like the pool area, which is down. Here's the furniture stop. So this one does say coming soon. Over here, it kind of reminds me of the potion shop that we had briefly. The playground is down over here as well. And the mansion. The obbies. <gasps> Guys, the mansion. Everybody loved that mansion up on the hill. I do have a full tour on it as well. But here is the playground. With the original swing sets, the slide, the obbies, the trampolines, and the ball. And we're almost to the mansion over here. So you can't see the mansion on the hill. It is pretty expensive. The only thing is, if you, all of this stuff is rentals as well. So if you do go ahead and purchase any of the homes or the mansion, if you log out of Adopt Me, you actually lose that progress. So you won't be able to go back into the home. You need to earn the money again. But there is the mansion on the hill, which we're not gonna be able to get into. But like I said, I do have a tour. We also have the grocery store over here. The OG, the original, you can still buy all of your pies, your food, your tacos, your popcorn, and your hot dogs over here as well. And then we're actually getting into the neighborhood. So there is the pool over here that is actually behind where you can go and you can play tennis as well. There's the spa inside of there. Let me know you guys if you remember the spa, the tennis court. 
Now these are all going to be homes that you can rent as well. Like I said, the same at the mansion. If you log out, you are gonna need to repay that money once again. So let's go inside of here. So you can actually come in and there is the tennis areas. And then back here is the showers or the spa area. You can take a shower and then there's also the pool area in the back. So here's a spa right here. And back here is the pool. Ta-da! <laughs> and then if we go over here is the neighborhood with all of the homes that you guys will be able to rent and go into. They're super teeny tiny. I don't think we have enough rent for 100. We only have 25 bucks. This one is 100, so you are gonna be able to rent all of these. There also is this building at the very end with the red windows that is currently coming soon as well. I don't remember exactly what that was supposed to be, but yeah, you're gonna be able to rent all of these. If you leave the game, you will actually need to re-rent them. But that is everything in today's video, you guys. I will leave a link for Adopt Me Legacy 2017. If you guys do wanna check it out, make sure to check out the link so that you do know it is in the official. Oh my gosh, this building is so pretty. I wonder if they're going to actually open it. <gasps> All right, you guys, so let me know if you wanna see more Legacy Adopt Me in the comments below. Give today's video a very big thumbs up and I will see you all next time. Bye guys.